crash in the gas lift sends two men to the hospital with serious injuries overnight. 10 News reporter Nate Holmes joins us live from downtown. And Nate, one of the men was ejected from that car. That's right. The passenger in the car received life threatening injuries. He was taken to the hospital moments after the crash. We're on 7th Avenue and you can see actually right here. This is where the car crashed and took a uh, took out a, a bus sign and you can see it's laying right there in between the cones and the fence here on 7th Avenue. This is also a parking lot right behind there that was shut down for the time being. Environmental services were out for about an hour when we arrived on scene this morning, cleaning up the area after splatters of blood were left on the curb from those men's injuries. Now here's a look at the scene earlier this evening. Now police had the entire block shut down and this crash happened just before midnight. Police tell us the driver, a 23 year old man, was speeding down Market Street. He tried making a left turn on 7th Avenue when he hit the curb, lost control of the car, and it overturned. That's when the 24 year old passenger was ejected from the car. Now, police say his injuries include a crushed pelvis and internal bleeding. The driver received a large gash on his head. Now, police have a reason to believe that alcohol may have played a factor in the crash and traffic division is investigating the crash. Live in downtown, Nate Holmes, 10 News.